excited to be part of you guys despite the fact that we're in Switzerland. So we made it here, we made it over a year and the kids are doing very well at school and John wants to birthday, say probably a little more about that. Yes, as you can probably see from all of these faces, everybody has grown quite a bit. They've achieved a lot this year. We are extremely proud of all five of our children. They've learned a lot. They've had to step up a lot. Step up. It's been a big change and they have done great. Yeah, so they're busy learning at school, German obviously, and they've as well tied as Marcus, they have French. So they come home with lots of homework, way more than in Canada, so they're, they're doing lots of work. They do as well piano practicing, saxophone, and instruments, all those things. Okay, Leah. <laughs> and Leah's learning lots of English as well as German. Do you know a little bit German, Leah? Yeah, but I don't know it. Oh, wow. Yeah. You got the spritz, huh? <laughs> I don't know that one, but oh, crap, crap, crap. Because I don't know it because it's like, oh, so okay. I know Leah it. Leah speaks Swiss German with her grandma very yeah. well, but she doesn't speak it with us so much. So she's definitely learning. This fall will be some big changes for our family. Big Titus changes. completed the school here in our community of Turkey. He'll be going to what they call uh, the over school in the neighbor community. He will need to bike about 20 minutes one way, two times a day uh, to go there for school and back for lunch and then back again in the afternoon. Uh, he has much longer school hours. He has to be at school at uh, 7.30 every morning. So it's a big change. I love you, goodbye. But we're proud of him <laughs> stepping up to the next level. There's some other details with the schedule. But we are going to Canada again. Yeah, we are as well connected in our church in the Seetal Gila. Um, in about two weeks, I'll preach again, so I'm excited about that. We have uh, other connections, not just to that church, here the local church, to other churches. So, Chosen has lots of connections with ladies. Uh, prayer groups, she's in more than one. Maybe she wants to say a little bit about that as well. Yeah, I have joined two uh, mums in prayer groups in two different villages. Uh, it's really good for me. They're all in German or Swiss German. Mm -hmm. The ladies translate some, but uh, I don't understand a lot. But it's one of my ways of making sure I always am moving forward in learning language. I do not have as much language as the children and must make a special effort that I keep moving forward in that. Uh, we've also joined the band, the brass band, uh, in this community. Daniel has long, old connections there. But they've also allowed a violinist to join their ranks. And because of that connection, too, I've been getting connected with some of the Reformed Church. This is right here in our community, uh, which is a huge answer to prayer. And it's definitely our heart that our church and that we would be for the community that we're in. So God is opening some doors, it's all ideas at this point, but some really fantastic connections. Yeah, so as you see, we settled in. Uh, we are as well super excited to come to you guys when Corona is over. I mean, the kids, and especially Jocelyn, she is super eager to come, and I would love to come too and see in person and to, to connect again and to be with you guys. So now you are in our prayers, and we, we believe the best for you. We hear good reports, so we are super excited. Our uh, our church is thriving, and so we send our blessing from here, from Switzerland, to you guys in three hours. Wish you all the best. Bye bye. I love you, buddy. Goodbye.